if an entity refers to itself, it's called a self-reference. Examples could be any social networking site, LinkedIn, Facebook. They have users and users can have followers, connections and friends. These followers and connections, they're also users. Second could be your employee applications where each employee can have manager, but these managers also employees. Third one that I can think of is uh, e-commerce sites where product can be sold together with another product, bundled product, but these bundled products are also products. So in all of these cases, you will have to have a relationship with the same table. Let's see how we can implement this in our systems. So this is my service studio. I'm inside a reactive web application and have an entity called product. It has these attributes, just a typical product. And I've also boosted this entity with some sample data. Let's keep an eye on the ER diagram as well. So to be able to create a self-reference, you will normally create an attribute. So I'm using control or maybe just use the right click here and create a bundle product. Okay. Now the trick is to choose the right data type. The data type of this product, this bundle product should be same as the product identifier to create a self-reference. How it's done, just expand it. Very simple, product identifier. And now we have a self-relationship. Although you don't see the connection here, but it's sort of referencing to itself, you know, it's coming here. And that's how you create self-reference. Next part would be to see how it looks on the screen. So for that, I'll just do the usual of dragging and dropping product entity to create our usual listing and detail screen. Since uh, all the attributes are part of one single entity, uh, the form that gets created for product detail here already has the attribute of bundle product and it's a drop down that allows us to select the uh, product, any, any of the previously added product. So I can go ahead and publish now. Almost ready. Let's launch it. I'll give it a refresh for my bootstrap function. And if I open any of the products here and see the detail, you can see here bundle product. I can now fix this up with any of the product and just get saved. Just to see if it's working, LIFX has the Fitbit charger. So that's how you do self-reference implementation in our systems. Thanks for watching.